The reticule with two coppers. Once upon a time there was an old woman and an old man. The old woman had a hen that laid eggs twice a day, but the old man had a rooster. One day, the old man asked the old woman for some eggs, because he was very hungry. But the old woman refused him, and suggested that if he wants eggs he needs to ask his rooster, as she also asks her hen. The old man, craving eggs, catches the rooster and begins to spank him, not knowing that roosters don't lay eggs despite his cravings. When the rooster escapes from his hands, runs away from home. On the way, the rooster finds a reticule bag with two coppers, which he takes in his beak and leaves for the old man's house. Along the way, a carriage with a nobleman appears, who asks the coachman to take the rooster's bag. Angry, the rooster sets off after the carriage shouting. cock a doodle doo Mighty nobles, give me back my bag with coppers. The nobleman tells the coachman to catch the rooster and throw it into a well. The rooster swallows all the water from the well and goes after the nobleman again. Arriving home, the nobleman orders a maid from the kitchen to catch the rooster and throw him into the hot furnace. The rooster pours over the fire all the water he has swallowed from the well and cools down the furnace. When the nobleman sees that the rooster got off the furnace, he orders the coachman to throw him into the herd of cattle, to be trampled underfoot or gored by some bull. The rooster swallows all the cattle and starts shouting again at the nobleman's window. Cock a doodle doo. Mighty nobles, give me back my bag with coppers. Finally, the nobleman throws the rooster into the money vault. The rooster greedily swallows all the money and again calls out. Cock a doodle doo. Mighty nobles, Give me back my bag with coppers. Seeing that he has no escape from the rooster, the nobleman gives him back the bag with coppers. The rooster takes the bag in his beak and heads home. All the nobleman's farm animals followed him. The old man was surprised when he saw his rooster as big as a mountain, accompanied by so many farm animals. The rooster shakes his wings with strength and pulls out all the money he swallowed from the nobleman and all the cattle, until the whole farm is filled. Seeing what the rooster had brought, the old woman, out of spite, also decided to spank her hen, but the poor hen brought only a bead. The old man out of compassion allowed the old woman to care for his animals, so that she would also have something to eat.